All right, so I'm gonna do a quick demo here. Um, so I need to do some temperature measurements for the hab testing stuff. And I got these three uh, one wire communication temperature probes that are waterproof from SparkFun. Uh, they're pretty cheap and they speak one wire, so that's always great. Uh, that's connected to an Arduino and then that passes over through serial of three temperature values to processing. I threw this together in like less than half an hour, so I really didn't have a whole lot of time. Um, so what it does is it plots it uh, and gives you a temperature reading out here. It will also tell you if you're d applying a thermal shock to the board. Uh, it's a handy feature, so if you're cooling it too fast, you may be damaging the board and it will notify you. So if I were to grab one of these sensors and just pull onto it with my hand and heat it up, you'll see, I don't know which one I just grabbed, but we'll soon see one of them rise up a bit. Okay, so the third one, you can see it slowly rising up there. Um, I don't have auto scaling just yet, but I'll have that later. Um, but it's just a nice uh, plot to see if it's rising or falling or whatnot. Um, so now what I'm going to do is rapidly cool it. So I'm going to place it here. I have an air duster that I'm going to spray upside down against it. And then we'll see that green marker uh, drop down significantly. And it will also give us a temperature warning. Or a thermal shock warning, I'm sorry. So you can see it's saying, thermal shock, thermal shock, what the hell are you doing? You're cooling the board way too fast. Um, essentially, it's, a diff it's doing a differential on the previous and current data input for temperature. And if it goes too steep, it'll just tell you, hey, you're going too fast. Um, so that would be handy, but yeah, it works. It's working just fine. This goes down to about negative 55, and I have it plotting up to 40C. So, yeah. Neat little quick demo. Ooh, that's cold. Anyway.